Chances are you already know that eating too much sugar is not good for you. Yet you are probably still overdoing it. Americans take average about 270 calories of sugar each day. That's about 17 teaspoons a day, compared to the recommended limits of about 12 teaspoons per day or 200 calories. Sugar occurs naturally in all foods that contain carbohydrates such as fruits, vegetables, grains and dairy. Since your body digests these foods slowly, the sugar in them offers a steady supply of energy to our cells. Consuming whole foods that contain natural sugar is okay. However, problem occurs when you consume too much refined or processed sugar. That is sugar that food manufacturers add to produce to increase flavor or extend shelf life. Refined sugars can be hard to spot on nutritional levels since they can be listed under a number of names such as corn syrup, agave nectar, palm sugar, sugar cane juice or sucrose. No matter what it's called, sugar is sugar and in excess, it can negatively affect your body in many ways. Here in this video, we will try to find how sugar affect your body. What is sugar? Sugar is a natural ingredient that has always been part of human diet. It is a form of carbohydrate. The body breaks down all carbohydrates into glucose, which enters the blood stream and acts as a source of energy. Sugars are an important source of energy, with glucose being the most important for the body. Our brain requires around 130 grams of glucose per day to keep functioning. There are different types of sugars, which vary in the structure of their molecules. Some sugars such as glucose, fructose and lactose occur naturally in food and drinks, while others are processing and refined sugars. Many healthful food products such as dairy products, vegetables and fruit naturally contain sugar. The sugar in these foods gives them a sweeter taste. It is important for people to include these foods in their diet as they come with a range of other nutrients that provide valuable health benefits. Unlike foods and drinks that naturally contain sugar, those with processed sugar provide no nutrition value. They are also a poor energy source as the body digests added sugar very quickly. Consuming too much may cause health problems over time. Effect of sugar on your body Researchers are still exploring the exact mechanism by which different sugars, including fructose, affect the body. However, they have already found many negative health effects that are related to excess sugar consumption, like heart disease. High sugar diets may increase the risk of heart disease. The result trusted source of 15-year study suggested that people with a lot of added sugar in their diet are significantly more likely to die from heart disease than people with minimal amounts of added sugar in their diet. Weight gain A significant risk of consuming excess dietary sugar is weight gain. In most cases, sugary foods and drinks are high in calories. Consuming too many of these products will lead to weight gain, even with regular exercise. There is a strong evidence trusted source showing that excess dietary sugar is a cause of weight gain. Diabetes Evidence shows that people who consume high amounts of sugary foods or drinks are more likely to be at risk of type 2 diabetes. Dental health Sugar consumption can cause tooth decay, which may lead to development of cavities. After eating sugar, bacteria in the mouth form a thin layer of plaque over the teeth. These bacteria react with the sugar present in food and drinks. This reaction triggers the release of an acid that damages teeth. Sugar effect on brain Sugar sustains you for less time than a slower releasing energy source such as nuts and protein. Some people describe experiencing an energy diff after eating sugar, a lethargic feeling that may make you less active, drink excess caffeine or crave more sugar. If you have diabetes, too much sugar can lead to kidney damage. The kidneys play an important role in filtering your blood. Once blood sugar levels reach a certain amount, the kidneys start to release excess sugar into your urine. If left uncontrolled, diabetes can damage the kidneys, which prevents them from doing their job in filtering out waste in your blood. This can lead to kidney failure. Depression Eating sugary snacks lead to release a dopamine, a feel-good chemical in the body. As this surge reduces, the brain begins to crave again for the same high. High sugar intake has been connected to depression in adults. How much sugar is okay? If 24 teaspoons of added sugar per day is too much, then what is the right amount? It's hard to say, since sugar is not a required nutrient in your diet. However, the American Heart Association suggested that men consume no more than 150 calories, about 9 teaspoons or 36 grams of added sugar per day. 
you should limit it less than half of your daily allowance of calories the extra calories you enjoy after all your nutritional needs are met sugar is not unhealthful in itself however consuming a natural source of sugar is better for health than consuming refined or processed sugars so i recommend you reduce your sugary diets and go to the natural foods and vegetable for a stay healthy thank you